This video will demonstrate how you can use Socrates to create a new CMN700 project. First thing we need to do is create a new project. To create a new project, go to the Project Explorer tab and right click on the white space and select Socrates project. This opens the new project window. Follow the on-screen instructions to create the project. You can configure most IPs without having a bundle and a license for it. However, to build the IP exact and the Vitalog output, you must associate the IP catalog entry with the licensed IP bundle. To associate an IP catalog entry with the IP bundle, go to the IP catalog tab. In the IP catalog tab, select the folder or IP entry you want to associate the IP bundle. Right click on the IP catalog entry and select associate IP bundle. In the bundle IP location, enter or browse to the location of your downloaded IP bundle. And optionally, you can select overwrite existing associations option. And after that, click finish. We can see in the console tab that the IP association step was successful. And our next step now is to create and configure a CMN700 component. In the IP catalog tab, double click on the CMN700 version that we have just associated. And this will bring up the create configured IP window. Choose the project that you have created in the first step and click finish. This will bring up the create a new CMN mesh configuration wizard where you can choose from three options to create your CMN700 mesh. So first option we have is to use an existing topology YAML file to create a CMN700 component. With this option, you will be able to reuse your previous mesh configuration to make changes or to use it in a different project. Option two, you can also use an example mesh topology provided by the IP bundle. An option tree, you can create a new mesh that matches your requirement from the scratch. For this demo, we will use the option two. So select the option to use an existing mesh template. In the template field, select the CMN704 and click next. After the CMN700 configuration process has finished, the configured component opens in the mesh editor.